On this episode of Bad Nerd, I'm trying Lester's Fixin's Buffalo Wing Soda. Hey everybody, welcome to Bev Nerd Video Podcast. This is episode 91. Today's recording date happens to be March 23rd, 2012. We're uh, on location at the Guest House Inn at Norcross, in Norcross, Georgia. Um, yeah, last week was crazy. If you haven't followed the Facebook and Twitter streams, we were at Momocon, a pretty cool anime, comic book, video game convention at the Marriott Marquis in downtown Atlanta, Georgia. Uh, we're actually here again, at least just my wife and I. We're in Georgia again for the weekend. Um, we're going to a live Nerdist podcast tomorrow night at the uh, Variety Playground. You know, that's uh, comedian Chris Hart. Uh, we're going to check them out, and we figured might as well do some episodes while we're in the uh, hotel room. And if you see the picture I posted on Facebook, it looks quite unsavory in here, but I assure you, this is a decent room. It just doesn't really look that good with having uh, lighting and cameras. It's... Pretty soon, I think I might hear the pizza delivery guy come, and we don't have any money. Anyways, but if you do have money, I've got something that I may interest you with. On today's episode, I'm trying Lester's Fixin's Buffalo Wing Soda by Rocket Fizz, um, a, a couple of uh, soda stores out in the West. But this was sent to me for review, along with this corn soda, spruce beer, zombie brain juice, and Pete's Pumpkin Patch Soda. Uh, from my friends at www.old52.com They're like a an online cornucopia of all sorts of cool vintage unique glass bottle sodas classic candies toys other things and um, uh, Go to old52.com you can find all sorts of their locations um, You can also purchase from their online store at shop old52.com And if that sounds like something you'd want to do I've got a secret thing for you uh, this expires at the end of March, so you might want to use this. This is a coupon code right here. It gets you $4 off any purchase of $23.50 or more. That's a really random number. Um, it sounds like it, but here's the math behind it. It's like buying 10 individual glass bottled sodas, and you get two free. But as long as your total adds up to $23.50, you can use that code. Um, so yeah, we've had a Lester's Fixing Soda on here before. It was the bacon soda. It smelled like bacon. Boy, did it taste like bacon. And they got the bacon flavor in there naturally. And it was pretty accurate. It's just really, really weird. I thought the flavor was good, but um, very unique and not for everyone because I shared it afterwards and some people thought I was a jerk after that. But this is the Buffalo Wing Soda. It's made in the USA. The ingredients are carbonated water, sugar, citric acid, sodium benzoate, which is a preservative, ester gum, natural flavor. Hmm, I might find a chicken bone in here. Uh, yellow 6, caramel color, and red 40. Um, comes from us, Camarillo, California. Um, not going to do a pour in a glass. I don't have glasses. All we have are the little plastic disc, the little Dixie cups by the sink, which we'll need to use for brushing our teeth later. But you, you can see, you can, you can clearly see it because it's clear. Okay. I hope this twists off because we don't have a we don't have a thing. Ah, okay. All right. Super car. It's, it's got some good carbonation. You can definitely see like some fizzing action, or at least just stuff coming out. This sure. This smells spicy and sweet at the same time. It smells like chicken and like buffalo wing sauce but it's sweet and like not it's got like a moist smell to it too because it's a drink but it's got like a moistening thing going on in my nose this is going to be equivalent to eating a, a, a bernie bot to every flavor bean isn't it yeah i didn't mind the bacon soda this one's i'm i'm scared to death That's rough. My tongue is tingling. 
I'll take another sip. It tastes like the sweet armpit of the red rooster dipped in hot sauce. <coughs> oh, Terry Taylor would be so sad. Oh. You want to try some, Amanda? Mm -mm. No? Okay. Wow. I'll pass. Mm. I don't e I don't even know. It, it tastes like chicken juice. And it's like spicy. I don't. I mean, I'm getting a little bit of the buffalo action, but a real buffalo wing is way stronger as far as like the. It's like spice content. I mean, there is like a little burning sensation like in the, in the, in the bottom of my throat. It's got a terrible aftertaste, guys. It's got it. The aftertaste is straight up verp. It this it, the, the aftertaste is straight up vomit burp. Oh. Now I. I, I don't. I don't know. I don't know if I have anything redeeming about this soda. I mean. I guess it kind of smells like uh, buffalo wings, but not really because it smells like a soda and it smells like kind of sweet, but that taste. Ugh. I would give me two bacon sodas. In fact, I'd rather take a bacon and vanilla ice cream float with the bacon Lester's Fixin' Sodas than ever. I'm going to tell you what though. I'm going to put the cap back on it. I'm going to take this back to Alabama and make Jay Bear try it, and I'll get a little video because, I, you know what? I think I would rather drink the spruce beer than this, even though that I couldn't finish the spruce beer. There's no way in hell I can finish this. This is, it feels like I'm hurting myself. I, I, I feel like I'm inflicting self-harm when I drink this. It's like I drink it, my brain's like, you're such a jerk, why are you doing this to me? That concludes this review um, of uh, Lester's Fixin's uh, Buffalo Wing Soda. Um, you know, you can choose 10 sodas and you get two free with this coupon code. Um, they have a large variety of sodas, so if you can't find something within 10 to 12 sodas, just pick something at random and hope it's not that. Just run away. Run far away. Run so far, you go straight to Bevner.com. Um, that's where you can find other sorts of video reviews of soft drinks, snack foods, and craft beer by Jay Bear, my friend. Um, there's links at the top of the page, brand new. It's um, one's the audio from our panel at MomoCon Saturday, last Saturday night. We had a panel. We had uh, Ugavi, Cocaine Energy, Buzz Best Cookies, and Cafe Mallows. We did reviews of that. Unfortunately, we didn't have any good video video content that we could use. It's all blurry and awful. But I ripped the audio from it, and it actually is it's a fun 25-minute romp with myself and Jay Bear uh, towards the tail end. And also on the front page of Bevner.com, there's a photo album. We took about 100-plus pictures at MomoCon of our booth, ourselves, people that are awesome cosplayers holding up great products. Check those out, too. And also around the top, right underneath that, there's links to where you can just easily like us on Facebook, follow at Bevner on Twitter, and subscribe via the YouTube. Um, lots of great things are coming up, so this is uh, it. Bye.